move on to the next topic here. Major League Baseball making some news. Now, it's not the news that we necessarily want right now, but you know, we'll we'll take this for right now. MLB and AT&T's Turner Sports have agreed to a blockbuster extension for their League Championship Series playoff rights. Andrew Marchand of the New York Post reports. While exact price tag per year and duration are unknown at this time, he said there have been talks about raising the annual cost from $350 million to in the range of $500 million per season. That is bananas. Uh, and he said it's definitely a blow to Disney's ABC ESPN, which had hoped to acquire these rights. Um, but they can, obviously, ESPN is still going to have baseball, all that kind of mess. Um, this is incredibly weird to have these talks and to get this kind of a deal done while you are in the middle of complaining to the players about how you're not making money this season, right? Like, it's it, it's tough to, to win either side of this right now when that comes out. And I, I didn't know see, what I to think of this. All right, so I, I see this a little differently. Okay. okay. These conversations are happening now because they're in a big stalemate with the players. And the only thing that they feel like they can do to get their sport back is they got to find a way to make more money. Okay. okay. And so if you renegotiate your deals that you have and you know on the back end of this thing you have a lot more money coming in, they might be willing to make a better deal with the players today. So yeah. if this year they do operate at a loss or whatever it ends ends up happening in their finances, they kind of can play a long game. Yeah. The players are unwilling to play a long game, and that's fine. Not not saying any one side's right or wrong, but this gives them the ability to play a long game. That makes sense. That makes sense. Um, that's that's why these no, these negotiations haven't been happening for the last three months. These negotiations recently started. Yeah. And you know, kind of came to 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 what they we think is going to happen, and and all that's happened during this stalemate with the players over the last you know couple of weeks. Let's uh, jump into the chat here. William said, with regards to college football's return, just pray Oregon doesn't quote duck out on the North Dakota State game. Now, I would love to see that game happen, so I'm I'm hopeful, but we'll see. Uh, Albert jumped in. I hope it doesn't end up with too many false accusations like me too did. Uh, agreed. Like, you hope that there are no false accusations. These just seem a little more... I, I uh, think I think these are very, they're a little similar. I think they're very different situations. Yeah, I, I do agree with that. I do agree with that. Will Gomez jumped in on Periscope. Uh, what's up, brother? How are you? Don't be surprised if we have games, but no fans if we see spike tick up. Uh, good gracious. Spike tick ups after the first week. Um, I mean, agreed. Like, We'll see, but I'm like Chris. I'm going to take every over right now. I think the stadiums right, are going right to be now. Fun. I'm still sitting on all the overs. I'm just yeah. I'm just betting we're gonna they're gonna let them football. I just feel like the game of football believes it's too big. Yeah, like they're going to do it. No and I'm not what. saying it's right or wrong. Once again, I'm not a scientist. I'm not a doctor. Don't do research. I don't know any of this shit. <laughs> I just know enough to know there's way too much money on the line for these these schools and for the NFL and I just think they are going to tell people we you're going to sign a waiver when you buy that ticket that yeah. says if you get sick here that's on you yep not our fault but welcome in we have 80,000 seats available Damian Estrada jumps in on YouTube said MLB going to be the next WCW uh oh. Tyrone oh. Tyrone oh. said hello guys Tyrone Davison what's up man uh, he said what do you think about NBA starting back up in July I think we we hit on that on last Friday's show. Uh, so you can go back and watch that. Um, we Well, a lot of things happened over the weekend that, that might change that. but that's uh, They came out and kind of refuted some of that. We got to dig more into that today. Um, because there, there were more reports that came out. Like there was the Kyrie thing, and then there wasn't the Kyrie thing. Like I'd, I don't know what's going on. We're going to have to read a little more on that. Um, let's see, 2020 virtual baseball. Uh, yeah, I mean, they were doing virtual racing for a little while. No, no, <laughs> no. MLB the show. Just show no. it on. <laughs> no. 
Will jumped in. He said, nobody's going to stop watching. The demand is so much higher because actors aren't working either. Uh, agreed. Like, I don't think anybody's going to stop watching anything that, when sports comes back this year. Uh, no, we'll no. see. The ratings are going to be unbelievable, yes. even if they're all on at the same time. It just doesn't matter. We Here's what's funny, okay? We spent the last four months stuck in our house. At some point in time, sports are going to come back on. Our asses aren't leaving the couch again for another six months. Yeah. Because we just got to <laughs> catch up on all these sports that we've been missing. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, Brown Yeti said 99.8% survival rate. That means we are in the stands. Yeah, I agree. I, I uh, just it, Listen, dude, it could be 70% survival rate. I, I think the NFL, I don't know about college, I think the NFL put butts in the seats, and they're going to just, at the back of your ticket says, if you bought this ticket, this it's is on, on you. you. Yeah. Uh, William Brown said TV deal values will just rise with more people watching from home. There are some conference deals coming up in the next couple of years, too. Even Hulu might make a play. Uh, I mean, we'll see. Obviously, everybody understands these are uh, strange circumstances that are going on right now. Uh, yes, I could see Hulu making a deal for, you know, Big 12 rights coming up in 2023 or 2025, whatever it is. Uh, I mean, we could see more conference expansion. We can see all kind of different stuff going on with that. But, I mean, who knows? Who knows? Uh, 